Hello, my name is David Summons, Creative Director here at Grace Root Designs here in Dallas, Texas. And today we're going to talk about how to change the settings of your temporary internet files folder. Now, your temporary internet files folder controls the browser cache for Internet Explorer. It also controls the preferences for your browser history, how often it's saved, and of course, as we know, cache helps the computer browser load preloaded images of websites to increase the speed of your browsing experience. To do this, we want to start by going to our Start menu and opening up our Control Panel. Once it's loaded, you want to locate the Network and Internet Options tab here. Now you want to go to the Internet Options and it should bring up an Internet Properties dialog box here. In the second row, you want to locate Browsing History, and you want to select the Settings options within that row, which will open up a third dialog box titled Temporary Internet Files and History Settings. Now here, as I mentioned, you're controlling the browser cache and browser history preferences. So you're going to be able to select the options in terms of how frequently you want your browser to search for updated versions of the web pages, images, and media for faster viewing later. So you can control your cache with these options here. You can have it do it automatically or every time you start Internet Explorer or every time you visit a specific web page. Simply make your change there with the select radio button. And also, just below that, it gives you the disk space usage options. Here, as you can see, I have it set to 250 megabytes. You can actually increase or decrease this number here. And then we can even change the location of the temporary internet files folder with using these options here. You can move the folder, you can view the objects, you can even view the files individually. The last option it gives you pertain to the browser history in Internet Explorer. You can specify how many days Internet Explorer should save the list of websites you've visited. So you can keep the pages in your history for any number of days using this box. You can simply type in the number that you desire or use the arrows to direct increase or decrease the quantity of those days. Once you have your settings set to your uh, specific preferences, simply select OK, which will save, and then select and close that third dialog box taking you back to the Internet Properties dialog box. And here you want to select OK, which will save your Internet Properties and Internet Options that you've just created. Thus, you're changing and editing the settings for your temporary Internet Files folder. Once again, my name is David Summons, Creative Director here at Grace Root Designs in Dallas, Texas, and today we talked about how to change the settings of your temporary internet files folder.